What's up everybody, welcome back to my channel. Everyone who's on YouTube for a longer period of time has at least one video that was never uploaded. Do you have one? Because I have. <laughs> we had fun and I thought this would be one of my best videos ever. But when I started editing, oh my, I already said, uh, nope, this won't be uploaded. I mean, let's just not talk about this. Here is that video's intro. What's up guys, you're obviously not here to see this Philly fan or to learn about this magic trick. Almost everything is fucked up in this five seconds. I recorded this in manual mode and this was the first video that I ever recorded in manual mode. But it's not the picture quality that makes this video cringy. What are you doing behind the camera? I just got changed, Vans. <laughs> <laughs> Sit down. You guys are here to learn about this picture. Boring. Let's see how to take a picture like this without a backdrop. So backdrops can be really expensive. Mm. Yeah. It can literally cost you an arm and a leg. <laughs> <laughs> Even if you buy just a $1 black tablecloth from the dollar store I got that! I got that! The title of this video is How to take this picture with no backdrop So let's see Well first you will need some lights And you will need an orange Well, since this is not a lemon party We're <laughs> gonna go with an orange You open one of your windows Point your lights straight out the window, but not too far because you don't want to call Batman. Batman. Just about five feet from the darkness. Cut the orange. After this, you go back to your room to take out the teasing lights that you bought for Valentine's Day to bump up the sexy time mood. Unfortunately, she broke up with you, and now you're using these lights to take stupid pictures with lemons or oranges. <laughs> you hang these up somehow. Beautiful. Check out the nicest half of the lemon. Orange. And obviously I forgot to shoot any footage when I took the picture. But here is the end result. It's an orange with lights in the background. Nah. And that's how you make a thousand followers on Instagram. Hmm. If you say so. So as I said, I have a video that is too bad and too cringy. And I never uploaded it to the YouTube. Or did I? Anyway, what did you do with the bad footage that you recorded back in the day? I wanna know, comment section below. I'm pretty sure that I will have more videos that I will never upload. But until then, thank you very much for following my backdrop winter series and never forget, think less, do more. See you in my next video, bye bye. What do you think about this video? I'm not proud of it. Should we upload it? I'm in. Okay. Well, if you if you didn't like this video till now, I will leave a. What the fuck are you doing? This guy's got problems. 